Hello guys and welcome to Plus Eco. Today we'll talk about the global and local rotation button here in Unity. So this is very simple. Let's make this short. So when the when your button is saying global, what it means is that your we are moving objects relative to the world. So we have here a game object uh, with various cubes inside, but let's see the coordinates here. The axes are just like this. You can see. Uh, that they change, okay, and the same is for the game object. The colors match the directions when I change it, and this is because the global handle rotation is set like this. If I change that to local, it's still the same, right? Well, yes, until you change the rotation of the game object. Let me just turn the game object to this side. Okay, no big difference, right? But whenever you you change it to the move tool. Oh, what happened? Now we are facing this way. So the global still still meets the axis direction, but when we hit local, because remember this this cube here is the face of the object. Uh, the face of the object is pointing to the left now. Uh, it's not meeting with this requirement, this direction. That that is relative to the world. So the the local direction is relative to the game object itself. So I let me let me change this a little bit. Okay, now it's like this, and if I press the move tool again, oh, this is a mess, right? Uh, if you just want to move your object to the left or a uh, hub, you, you you really can't do it like in a, you like you are used to. But actually, you can. You just change this local to global, and you still can move your object uh, up and down, simple like that, and to the left or right. So remember when you should use local or global and his, sometimes if you have some errors check if you have the, the wrong button selected sometimes that happens just like this center and, and pivot thing it's very normal don't worry about that you you will get used to it so hope you guys learned something new in this little uh, li this little video and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching.